Welcome back everyone. In this video, we will explain formatting shortcut keys in MS Excel. In previous videos, we have explained all other shortcut keys like selection, navigation, cell editing, and data entry shortcut keys. In this video, we will explain all these formatting shortcut keys which are very helpful uh, for Excel users. So let's start start uh, the first shortcut key is Control B, uh, which is used for bold. For example, we have text here so by pressing ctrl b it will be bold like this and ctrl plus i is used to for italic okay to make it italic let's press it okay the text has been changed to italic and ctrl plus shift plus seven is used to add border to a cell for example here to this cell we want to add border so but ctrl shift and seven so it will add border look at the border and ctrl plus shift plus minus is used to remove border back Control shift minus it will remove the border back look at and control plus u is used to underline the text control plus u it will underline the text and the sixth six shortcut key is which is a control plus five control plus five is used just to strike through or text okay it will just draw a line in the middle of the text so let's do it control plus five look at straight through and Alt plus H plus 6. This is used for indentation. It means that it will add indent, uh, indent, okay, increase indent and decrease the indent. So let's do it, okay. Use this shortcut key for this text. Alt plus H don't, it means this, we don't have plus sign here. It means that don't press all keys together. But instead of that, plus H, press Alt, then leave it, then press H, then leave it, then press 6, like this, okay. So first of all, Alt leave the key then h after that six look at the indent increase the indent now let's decrease it back okay alt h5 is used to decrease the indent back alt h5 will decrease the indentation uh alt plus uh, alt h f g this uh, shortcut key is used to increase the size of text right now that is 14 let's increase it alt h f g look at the tick has been increased to 16 if you want to decrease it alt h f k alt h f k so the text has been decreased back to 14 uh control plus shift plus uh exclamation mark so this shortcut key is used to apply uh, apply number format with two decimal uh, places thousand separator and a minus sign for negative values so let's look at that let's press this shortcut key control plus shift plus exclamation mark so it add a, a number format for example look at the format then two decimal points thousand separator if the value was minus so it will add minus sign so this was the uh, control plus shift plus i shortcut key now let's move to the control plus shift plus hash this shortcut key is used to apply the date format with the day month and year okay day month and year this format so let's for example we have this number we want to change this to the date format so it will apply day month year format so let's uh, control plus shift plus hash look at first of all day then month then year so it will change that it, it is just used for the dates okay to format the date like this let's move to another um, shortcut key which is control plus shift plus dollar sign uh, this is used to apply the currency uh, format with two decimal places so for example uh, we have number here so it will apply currency format with two decimal points control plus shift plus dollar sign look at the dollar sign currency format in two decimal points uh, let's move to another shortcut key which is control plus shift plus percentage this shortcut key is used to apply the percentage format with no decimal places it means the the percentage format with no decimal places like for example this one so it will just apply percentage control shift percentage like look at the percentage this hundred has been added multiplied uh, let's move to another shortcut key which is control plus shift plus uh, uh, side. this is used to apply the time format with hour and minutes and indicate am or pm so let's for example control plus shift plus add so let's first of all add the time 
for example i added just this number so that has been applied okay directly applied let's add number here also control shift and shortcut key was at so look at will am uh first of all our minute and am or pm it will add like this let's move to another shortcut key control plus shift plus tilde okay tilde um, sign so this is used to apply the general number format okay it is applying general uh, number format for example uh, you have this number so this is general right now but okay that is general but it will apply the general format tilde that is all already general for example let's apply on this one control shift tilde so that is general look at the format has been changed to to general now let's move to another shortcut key which is alt plus uh, single quotation mark uh, this shortcut key is used to display the format style dialog box okay formats let's press that alt plus single quotation style dialog box okay it will display this one number general alignment font whatever is that so it will uh, show all those formats that we have been applied and control plus one this shortcut key is used to display the format sales dialog box control plus one that cell dialog box so these are some shortcut keys which is useful uh, in MS Excel for formatting you can format the text cell uh, so if you like this video don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel like this video and comment down thanks for watching